what's going on youtube come back at you with another video okay so we recently heard this news that ray j was handed over suge knight's life rights basically and given full control now we're getting a little bit clearer of a picture of exactly what's what suge knight has spoken out from behind bars the blast obtained of audio recorded phone call from suge where he basically addressed everything first of all um ray j is not overseeing everything the final call and the full control is actually still in the hands of his fiance he gave ray j the the um reins to run with basically whatever he wanted as far as death row specifically was concerned. So Ray J was brought in to handle any kind of death row related business that Suge Knight could, could be working on, um, books, movies, whatever the case may be. So everything else though is still controlled by the fiance. She has the power of attorney. She is the one who can make all the calls as far as Suge medically and basically his name uh, she still runs all that. So a little bit of misconception from what we heard initially. It seemed like when TMZ put the story out that Ray J was basically going to control everything. Now we're finding out it's more so just controlling the whole um, death row aspect of potential business. So Suge is quoted as saying, Ray J is the little brother and family, and he basically highly respects him. Another interesting part about this whole situation is Suge talked about bringing Nick Cannon on to handle a book on his life. So Nick Cannon coming in now to do some Suge Knight book. This is huge news for Nick Cannon. Um, Suge Knight also described Nick Cannon as the most realist guy in the business today. So that's saying a lot. Obviously, Suge highly respects Nick Cannon. He's again calling him the most realist guy in the business today. So this is big news. Again, um, Suge Knight behind bars, 28 year sentence. He actually addressed this also. He said, as far as his whole case is concerned, I'll be home before you know it with big plans apparently to be taking care of his family. So Suge Knight masterminding a scheme from behind bars to get out, and not a scheme, but a plan to get out and you know potentially make some big business moves while he's in the process of waiting. This is big news for Suge. Lots of interesting things going on. It's going to be real interesting to see what comes out of this. If you didn't hear the initial reports, there was actually talk of bringing back death row in some capacity, although they were saying it was a long shot because they would probably need more investors and um, you know the situation would have to be just right. But a new death row, 2020 death row, like, oh, this shit it sounds crazy to me. Let me know what you guys think in the comments, though. I appreciate you watching. Hit the like, subscribe, share. Make sure you leave some feedback. And make sure you also ring the bell before you leave. I do appreciate you, though. Peace.